So the next step to get ready to do your punch needle embroidery is threading your needle. Now this is a two-step process um, because you have to get the thread all the way through the handle of the needle and then out through the eye of the needle. So what you want to do first is select the depth that you want to do your punch needle embroidery. And I do all of mine set at number one. This gives a nice, even, low uh, loop on the front, which resembles a miniature hooked rug. So then once you've got your, dot, your number dialed up to the, the depth that you want, then you take your threader and you're going to thread it from the tip of the needle all the way to the other end. So you just lie it down on top of the needle and then you push it all the way through. And then it should come out the other end of the handle. So then you just take your three strands of embroidery floss, and this is the Valdani um, floss that I'm using, and you just tuck it into that end um, of the threader, and then you pull. And you'll see that it pulls all the way out through the tip of the needle. So then remove that thread from the threader, and then what you want to do, the second step, is to stick the threader in from the back of the needle. So you'll see, when you're looking at your needle, that the one side is straight up and down, and the other side has the bevel or the um, angle. So the angled side, the bevel, is the front of the needle. This side, the straight up and down, is the back. So you want to take your threader and stick it through the eye of the needle from the back, and then out through the front. Then you just stick the end of your floss in that little loop again and pull. Now, once you've threaded it, if you can pull your thread back and forth like this, then you know that your needle is threaded correctly. What you want to do is pull back on the thread until you have a little tail about an inch long, and then you're ready to go.